Hello everyone! Are you looking for an efficient way to create Google Meet lessons on your online learning platform? Look no further, let me introduce you to the best WordPress LMS plugin, Master Study. From now on, with our plugin, you can easily integrate Google Meet and create engaging meetings. In this video tutorial, I will demonstrate how to create meetings for administrators and instructors separately, making the process fast and simple. Right now, I've logged in the system as admin and I need to go to my WordPress dashboard and enable the add-on. I will search for Master Study LMS and from add-on section. By the way, add-ons are available only for our Pro and Pro Plus members. And I'm gonna enable the Google Meet add-on. Make a note of that Google Meet add-on will work if and only if you enabled SSL settings in your website, which means HTTPS. Great! To set up the Google Meet add-on as admin, I need to go to settings, set up withered appeared, this one, and basically there are four steps that we need to take. First we need to create a credential in Google Developers Console. So let me go to Google Developers Console. And I'm gonna select a project. If there is no any project listed here, I'm gonna create a new one. To here I'm gonna write down the project name. Choose the organization and click on create. After successfully creating a project, the next thing that we need to do is to enable APIs and services. And I'm gonna search for a Google Calendar. I'm gonna choose Google Calendar API, which is first one. I'm gonna enable it. Ta -da! Right now I can create a credential by clicking this button. In our case, the data will be user data, and if we click on next. Here is the forum, which is Oath Consent Screen, and I need to fill it. So here I'm gonna indicate the app name, user support, email, uh, uploading a logo is not necessary, it's not mandatory, so I can skip it. And to here I'm gonna indicate the email addresses of my developers. Okay, let me fill it. Let me save and continue. We will not add any scopes and this section is completely optional, so we can skip it. And to here, we need to choose application type. In our case, it is a web application. To here, I'm gonna paste authorized redirect URIs. First, I'm gonna add one of them. And let me go back to the setup wizard of our Google Meet add-on. Let me press next. And here is the URL that I need to copy. I've copied it. And to here, I'm gonna pass the URL and click on create. Here you can see the generated JSON file, which is a credential file that we use to connect uh, this particular service to our Google Meet add-on. So let me press done. And the last thing that we need to do is to publish the app. So let me go to OS Consent screen and publish app. Confirm. The app published it right now. So let me go back to the settings of our add-on. Let me go next and here you can see the file that we have downloaded so I need to select this file which is this one. File selected and go ahead and click on next. And if I press to go to Google's content screen, the new screen is gonna be appeared and I need to give some permission to the Google that this add-on, this plugin gonna use my Google account. If you see this kind of a screen, it means that you have successfully set up your add-on as administrator. So you can create a new meeting, you can see the meeting list or change the um, mid account status, mid attendees, time zone or other settings from here. Right now I'm gonna log out from this account and I'm gonna log in as instructor and I'm gonna show how to set up Google Meet as instructor. Now I will log it in the system as instructor. So from the dashboard, I will search for Google Meet. Here it is. Let me open it. And this is the setup wizard for instructors. It is completely same with the administrator. 
So first we need to open developers console and create a credential for the instructor. So let me just speed up the video. Pay attention when it comes to authorize to redirect URIs. I need to copy and paste this URI that I got from the instructor's web page. I'm gonna select the file, this one, and the same thing. I'm gonna give permissions. If you see the screen, it means that you have successfully set up the Google Meet add-on. You can change the settings from here and create a new meetings by creating this button or this one. And always, uh, you will reach this Google Meet integration page from your dashboard or from here. Great, right now let's uh, move to the course builder and try to add some meetings to some of the courses. I'm inside of the course called Graphic Design Basics Masterclass and I'm gonna add a lesson in the section 2 which is at the Photoshop Basics. Let's assume I wanna give some live masterclass. To here we need to indicate a Google Meet name, start date, end date, end time, start time, and time zone and meeting summary as well. So let me speed up the video and fill out this information. Once you fill out the information, go ahead and press this create button and Google Meet successfully created. So right now I'm gonna log out from this profile and I'm gonna log in as student. See how it looks to students. Now I've logged in as student and let me go to enrolled courses and find out the course that we have modified, which is graphic design basics, this one. From the curriculum of the course, you can see there is a new thing, which is Masterclass by Senior Designer. If I press this button, I mean press this URL, here you can see how it looks to students. Masterclass by Senior Designer and how much time left, starts and if you want to join a meeting, just go ahead and press this button. Great! Uh, if you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to our channel to stay updated with amazing news and content. If you have any questions or inquiries about a plugin, feel free to leave them in comment section. We value your feedback. Additionally, if there are any specific videos you would like to see on our channel, please let us know in comments too. Thanks for your support.